Hello there everyone and welcome to our Mighty Kind standalone die release video. So in this release we have lots of lovely standalone dies. We have some florals, we have leaves, we have sentiments, we have cover dies and we also have a really large alpha too. So first up we have a Painted Blooms die set. Now this is a layering set and we have lots of different elements in here to layer up to create these really beautiful flowers and leaves. We do have the layering guide on the back so you can quickly and easily put these together. This is a great one for all occasions and we are sure you're going to love it. Next up we have Rose Queen die set. Now this is an outline die set and you're going to get three different elements in here which create really beautiful stunning images. This is a great one for inlaying die cutting but you could also use it just on its own for a really pretty design. have flowing foliage so you can see here that we have some beautiful kind of whimsical looking designs here we have four different leaves and a blossom that you can then create whole backgrounds with or use the separate elements to embellish any of your paper crafting projects we have pop-up dahlia and you can see that we have this large die here so it does come in one piece and it will kind of cut into your cardstock but not cut it out so you can then fold the petals upwards to create a really beautiful 3d design Next up we have Lovely Envelope. This one is really, really cute. So we have lots of little dies in here. We also have some layering suggestions on the front. And on the back we do have the layering guide for the envelope and the two small flowers that are within the die set. This is a great one for adding to your projects or even scrapbook pages. Next up we have Calming Reflection. Now this is a cover die, so it's four and a quarter by five and a half, so it will fit perfectly on the front of an A2 card. You can see on this die it's very natural looking. You can also layer this up to create a really beautiful background really quickly and easily, or just use it on its own if you want more of a subtle touch. Next up we have Simple Shapes. Now again this is a cover die so it's four and a quarter by five and a half so again we'll cover the front of an A2 card base. There's lots of different elements in this one and you could definitely use the kind of cut over pieces for different cards to create various different elements too.
Next up we have Be Kind die set. So in here you're going to get two different dies which layer together to create this really beautiful Be Kind sentiment. It is a quite sizable die so it's not going to get lost on any card that you put it on or even a scrapbook page. we have way to go die set so in this one we have four different dies we have two large way to goes which layer up perfectly and then we also have two smaller sentiments that say you rock and congrats in kind of a label style So last, but by no means least, we have the Mighty Alphabet die set. So in here you're going to get all of the letters for the alphabet and these are really quite large. They're not going to get lost on any card or scrapbook layout that you put it onto. I do love a good alphabet die set as this means you can create your own custom sentiments that you wouldn't find anywhere else. So here are all of the new standalone die sets that we have in our Mighty Kind release. We really do hope that you spotted something in here that inspires you and makes you want to create something beautiful. Thank you so much for watching everyone and we'll see you again really, really soon. Bye bye. Hello crafters, I hope you enjoyed that video. If you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the notification bell so you don't miss anything. Thanks for watching.